Let you know you're tuned in to Joy 99.7. I know you've been waiting with bated breath. Yeah, my guest is here. My super guest. I actually want to put something in the background to help me. Uh, you know, today for all days, I don't even know how to introduce her. All, all I know is that she's here. <laughs> and this is one of Ghana's favorites. Charlie, the legendary is uh, here. I'm talking about the legendary evangelist Stella Avasil. Don't you miss her? Do you remember her songs? What are your favorites? Yeah. All the questions you would want me to ask her, probably you can share with me. Send me a WhatsApp 055 1111 And I told you uh, on Thursday and Friday when I came on the radio that she said she'd bring in something different. So I need all of you to stay put and check out her. I don't know whether I will start hearing her melodious voice singing or talking before, but I want you to know that she's here with us, okay? Enjoy 99.7. This is up close. And it just feels good. Um, but you are ready. I am crowd one. I'm in my radio. <laughs> okay. So you can hear some keys in the background. But your boy, mama, huh? That's right. Uh-huh. When I asked her what she's bringing on, I say, ah, Ebe, I'm surprises are. It's important. We are all in for the surprise. I don't know what is coming. Okay, let's all just go with the flow. <laughs> praise God, praise God, praise God. It's what be alive. It's a precious gift. Not everybody has this opportunity to be alive. And so we are grateful unto God for the fact that we are alive. That alone is a miracle. We are grateful. The psalmist says, bless the Lord, O my soul. And all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not his benefits. This morning, that's exactly what we are going to do. Just for the fact that we are alive, we are going to bless his name. Over to you, Fee. (laughs) Oh, 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 what an atmosphere. So it's this is wonderful what, to be in yes, his presence. And this is what the legend it is brings. Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> what more can we do? F- what can we do for mm. him? What can we give him than our praise, our worship, our gratitude? Mm. The gold, the silver belongs to him. The mm. cattle on the cattle on uh, it belongs to him. Mm. What can we give him than our hearts? Our hearts. Our- Gratitude. Our gratitude. Good morning, world. <laughs> Today you heard it. I mean, the legend just brought her old thing. I kept asking, put your ass out, But also, I didn't hear myself. Is there a you keyboard? Know, you told me I hear oh, myself. you did not? No. The whole world were you hearing were enjoying you. It. you have I the, know, my yeah. my bad. My <laughs> you bad. Have given me one. I, I apologize. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> for okay, your, you for your mind. Thank you. Just for this, this show. I know, that. right? <laughs> 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 oh, what a joy to have you. Good morning. Good morning. Good to see exactly. you. Exactly, and welcome home. Thank you. Ah. There's no place like home. I know, I know. <laughs> so, so let's let's let me start off from mm-hmm. where have you been? To and fro. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Jesus even said it that the son of man, uh, birds have nests, uh-huh. foxes have holes, uh-huh. but the son of man has no has place. No place. <laughs> so we keep moving to. <laughs> Mama Stella! Yes, yes, yes. yes. So, how many years have you been doing this? There you go, you see. (laughs) This is an question. (laughs) You know, I said you and I, we we have all the feelings. I have answered these questions about about 10,000 times. Not not, not to to, to me on this network. So, let's start from somewhere. You know how we do it. Oh, my God. I'll put your, oh, well, you can start in the man. Yeah, you have to to all the other Mm -hmm. important matters, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm just, especially for, you know, knowing the the number of years, at least, uh, being active on radio uh, Mm -hmm. and even before playing your music mm-hmm. uh, you are still very active and uh, perhaps you. that's why i'm asking uh, how long have you been doing this a very long time wow. decades, decades. i'll say yes the legendary mm-hmm. good morning <laughs> now let me now that you want us to go into all the other matters right <laughs> I, I, I probably i'm just going to pick okay pick 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 okay. so tell me your story i know i had okay. a I had a privilege of uh, sitting with you in America. Yes. Uh, also in New York, right? Yes. Yes. Did you ever post that thing? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We shared it. Yeah, we I did. I know I'm not a social media I know. Person. You better get in there. <laughs> and I'm going to start off on that note because there was something you shared with me on that day that still really? hit me. That right, okay. you were the first artist uh-huh. 
to actually host a concert at the National Theatre. Oh, I opened it. Yeah, yes. Yes. yes, yes, yes. So I'm going to yes. ask you some oh, of the questions okay. that are not too yeah. popular. Okay. <laughs> Tell me about what happened. Well, you know, um, in fact, charismatism, if we had to write a book on charismatism and my name is not in that book, that book is a fiasco. <laughs> Trust me, we need to burn that book. I don't disagree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So we have really worked, toiled, uh, especially charismatism started under trees in classrooms mm. and stuff like that and with the singers moving along up and down so it got to a point you want to express yourself mm. you really want to share with the bro um, a, a different variety of people mm -hmm. that you have enough time to um, express yourself mm. and to share your gift with and um, there weren't there weren't many church buildings at that time mm -hmm. you know it was badding charismatism was badding so when national theater was built i said yeah this is my opportunity mm. i want to have s do something and uh, invite everybody across board orthodox whoever to come and enjoy the presence of god so that's how come we did a cars uh, we did a, a national theater and at that time i was charging five cities come and see hey why should i charge you know it's supposed to be free why would you charge five cities <laughs> you know and you have to educate the people explain to them that you rent the hall mm. you rent the instruments a, a lot of logistics go into it to get it done you know so to be honest with you it wasn't so successful because that was the first time somebody was charging gift fee that mm. was the first time mm. you know so there wasn't that much crowd but well i thank god that i can see gr now people understand that if you want to go to a christian event you pay and it's not an issue now mm. so i'm grateful to see the growth uh, along the years wow mm -hmm. because you charged yeah did you come and, and, and in fact a lot of calls even uh, one paper bashed me a new uh, a writer bashed me that I'm charging five cities, five cities, you know, <sighs> what am I going to do with their money? And Ooh. I said, if I make money, I'll buy instruments because those things were very difficult to acquire. Mm. You know, yeah, I'll get instruments. And before I did the program, I used to rent instruments by myself and I used to do school and college ministry. So I go to schools, a lot of schools in Accra, even teachers training college, Preseco, a lot of schools. I write to them. They give me their days, their days of worship. So I go, I worship with them. I, I, I quote the scripture. I, you know, I, I speak to them mm. because I believe I became a Christian very young in mm. school and it kept me, it protected me from certain things. So I felt that that's the right thing to do. Mm. So I used to go to schools and colleges, blah, 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 blah. So my intention was if I am able to make some money, I'll buy instruments. That mm. way I don't have to rent. Right. So a lot of people became born again. I make altar call. They come forward. La Bonne Secondary School, you know. Mm. And But I don't leave them like that. After those who become born again, I take people with me to visit them. Mm to see how they are doing. And then we pray for Holy Spirit baptism. We, we go then continuously to make sure that they are, mm. they are grounded. Mm. Then those days there were SUs. So we put them into the SUs. And some are pastors today, you know. Wow. Some are Glory. radio presenters. Some are, you know. So wow. that's, this is one of my stories. It is. <laughs> and, and the reason I asked you about the National Theatre one was that even though you were disappointed, it was as though the Lord opened a certain door for you. Because you had mentioned that the GBC was there. To, yeah, GBC to, to came with cover? their... They, they, they came with their OB van. Run, you know, yeah? the OB van, the whole crew, they televised it live. So, and you know, that time, GBC, the whole Ghana, is only one station. Mm -hmm. So the whole nation watched it. The live 
one hour. Wow. You know, so it's a blessing. I know. Yes. <laughs> I mean, this is an encouragement to someone. Even it's though it might look like they're disappointed, like the Lord has some some other blessing coming mm. through. Yeah, I, I, I really wanted to make some money to buy instruments. Mm. And it was for schools and colleges because I was renting from my own pocket. You know? Wow. Yeah, so I felt if I do this and I, I get some money, mm. the first thing I'll do is just at least set up drums and keyboard, you know, and the speakers, you know. <laughs> do you still need it now? Of course, more than. <laughs> okay. I mean, a whole, I need a studio, a, a TV station, radio station. <laughs> wow. Are, are you opening one soon? <laughs> no, I need, I need one now. <laughs> so, so that I'll invite you I bet, right? <laughs> to my station. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> It will be. I mean, it goes without saying. I'm seeing messages flooding already. People uh -huh. talking about how much you have impacted, you know, their lives. And oh. of course, like I said from the beginning, yeah. we cannot write. I, I agree with you. We can't write uh, charismatic uh, stories. The charismatic move. Without, without mentioning uh, your name somewhere We risked our lives. Mm. Our lives. What, what do you mean by that, risking your life? Traveling. You know, now now there are aeroplanes. Right. You know, so you can just fly 30 minutes, you're in commerce. But those days, we, we, we go by Ford. It wasn't even VIP now. I, I, I sit down and I cast my mind back and I said, wow, we were taking risk. Hmm. You know, and when we finish the program at night, you know, the next day you have another program, maybe Sunday. So you have to sit in the Ford in the night, 12 midnight just to get here early can you look at the number of mm. accidents that happen on our roads see how our roads are so dark mm. but no musician ever glory died. to god sometimes there are accidents mm -hmm. you know i remember Tego sisters and uh they, they are Evangelist spiritual yes yeah. they will finish crusade and they were coming he lost his life and Tego sisters Sadly. got uh, uh, um yeah. Uh, what do you call it? Omu pra pra. What, how do you say that? <laughs> Nanyin. <laughs> nah, no, that's uh. not <laughs> You know, so, I mean, we took risks, wow. but we, we, charismatism was referred to at that time by the um, print media that, uh, uh, what do you call mushroom churches. They, oh. they felt it would not survive. Oh, really? Uh -huh. No, because uh, before it was spiritual churches mm -hmm. and orthodox churches. Mm. Yeah, so the charismatism, they f felt it will not survive. We're making noise, you know, you know. So we really had to work hard, crusade right. upon crusade upon crusade. Now we, people don't do crusade. Mm. No, crusade is not, it's not, no. But first crusade, cluster of schools, the packs, crusade, 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 crusade. After crusade, then we organize uh, revival seminars, mm -hmm. you know. And it was about the cross. It was about having relationship with God. It was about being one with him and wanting to know him more mm. and, you know, wanting to be like him. And you want to hear his voice. You want to, you want to see him. Those were the messages we heard, you know. And so out of it, we sang messages from, we sang from the messages we heard. Really? Of course. That's what we are a reflection asking. Of what we heard hmm. from the pulpit. Yes. Because you want to be like, I want to be like you, Lord. I want to be one with you. Ah, uh, reveal yourself to me. Uh, I want to be holy as you. Make me like you. Let me hear your voice. You know, songs about the blood, songs about a healing. So, you know, mm -mm -mm. so. Scriptural so, songs. Uh, exactly. People complain and say, oh, no, no. The, song, the musicians, what is going on now? What's happening? I said it's as a reflection of what's happening from the pulpit. It starts from the head. You, you, are, you are talking about the now. People complain about the now mm. to me. Okay. Yeah, even yesterday. People complain. And the now, and the now, and what's going on. And in and, and those days, I said, we are a reflection of what we heard from the pulpit. Mm. What is happening also is a reflection of what people are hearing from the pulpit. If you say, somebody scream, I see you. Next week you will get a car. That's unreal. It's unreal. And so when they are singing, 
Maybe there could be a miracle. Go call me, brodo. Oh, yami be mobio. Sorry about that. I'm very sorry. Whoever wrote that song, you know. But in a in a way. <laughs> so you think that the foundation is faulty? Which foundation? With regards to getting the word, the scriptural based foundation word. as to who, where. Yeah. Be be. I know, right? You are, you are <laughs> so so I so I don't put you in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Me, you can never put oh, it there she goes. Yeah, 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 yeah. You have the right to ask any uh, question. Any question right. I reserve the I right to answer. answer. One, one, of, one of the things that I, I, I took away from that interview in America was you are no nonsense uh, personality. And so like, I am. <laughs> like, you know, Once a no nonsense, forever. always and forever. <laughs> so so, so t- take, me, take me to uh, those days started music. Like, uh, why did you decide to? Do music because while well, you were part the of the question? revival, the movement. Don't ask me. You, you could have been a, a, the a one prayer who made warrior. Me. Okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so the one who made you decided that he can give you that. I know, right? <laughs> I see. Okay. So let me rephrase the question. Uh-huh. At this point, when you knew that he had called you to do music, to 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 yeah, uh, what you call it, to sing as it were, to bless lives. Okay. Mm-hmm. You know, there's there's one thing. Uh, desiring something to do in life. And I want to believe that those days, just as you're talking about the challenges, mm-hmm. uh, you went through some. Maybe my question is, how have you sustained this till now? What are the challenges? If you can tell me the challenge, then I'll tell you. Oh, you you, uh, you, you mentioned traveling across, risking your life. These, the post uh, challenges, you didn't get studios to record those days. You know, it's like, a lot of work was done manually. You couldn't get money to get uh, the equipment you wanted. These were challenges perhaps that could mm-hmm. discourage you. Mm-hmm. But decades down the line, you're still doing this. Yeah. With the little with the little I did, you know, that I could gather and do, mm. the results I saw, because I, I used to follow up at the schools. Oh, you, you did? Know. Yes. You don't, you, do, you don't win souls and just leave them. You know, so I used to follow up. Maybe I, I'll go up. with someone. Mm. We go and on the uh, what do you call SU days, and all the people that I wrote their names, I go check, and they are there. You know, after we talk, you know, and that joy alone mm. is enough. Yes, and as I talk to you, a lot of them are pastors. They have their churches. You know, the joy of doing this. It's it's a joy. Mm. Yeah, at least. One boy did not go wayward, probably, mm. you know, one yeah. girl did not go wayward, yeah. you know, because a lot of things happen in the schools, a lot. Mm. It, it, it can be, parents know what I'm talking about. A lot of things are happening. Mm. So I believe that we have to catch them young Indeed. whilst they are in school. The moment they come out, you know, then the, the pressure of life, especially even when, when they enter the university, they are free. Mm. You know, they do anything they want Freedom to Freedom has come. Exactly. But when you get them before the university and they get grounded, you know, a certain fear mm. uh-huh, is instilled in them. Right. Uh-huh. And so even if they want to venture into something, something inside, yeah. the people will go click. You know, <laughs> <laughs> are you going back to the schools? Are you are you, are you going to go back? I I wish I could. Okay. I wish I could. I would like to. I love it. How can we encourage you? Money. Money. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Equipment and all that yeah. it takes. I will. I would like to do that because that is the real work. Mm. I I I know a lot of my product. I won't say my products, but. I was in touch uh, with some of them for a long time. When they move, they, they, they finish university, they go to, they get posted, they uh, they tell me, mm. you know, Mama, is this what is happening? Oh, Mama, I'm getting married. Really? Mama, you know. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, Mama, I have two children now. You know? <laughs> I you know, know right. Yeah, so it, that's something I love to do. That's the real work. Mm. Yeah, Evangelist Stella Abbasil is my guest this morning here on Reason is Jesus Joy 99.7 up close. And yes, uh, we're having a convo uh, along the line. Uh, we'll get back on the keys and do some singing, of course. Today, I want us to share what a prayer for those writing their BC, go well in uh, starting oh, really? tomorrow. BC's yes, yeah, starting tomorrow. Tomorrow, 
my children are grown, so <laughs> I know. I'm lost so, track so for, with for a mother and a grandmama as you are, we will humbly request that you do a prayer for them before we carry sure. on. But I want to talk about music, you know. Mm-hmm. Of course, the Lord calls you and says, Daughter, I want you to sing. Of course, the gift is there. Tell me about recording. What was the first song you ever recorded? It was English. English? Mm hmm. I won't ask you why. <laughs> Unless you tell well, me to ask your father. <laughs> no, I will, I will, um, my second church, I, in fact, I became a Christian in um, Ghana Evangelical Society. I was there for uh, five years. Um, brother, we call him Brother Gozo. Oh, Atuna. Enoch Abozo. Yes, oh, wow. He raised... Um, he raised a lot of us. Exactly. But I can mention a few names. Mm. Uh, Bishop Charles Ajinasari, mm. uh, Dr. Takia Boy, mm. the Stephen Stanley's. Wow. Uh, huh, you know, sorry if I, may, I call you Stephen Stanley, <laughs> but we'll go way yeah, back, know. you know. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, what did you say? I've lost track. No, you're talking about, uh, you know, I was talking about music and you talked about uh, starting off uh, recording English songs. But yes. You, you're giving uh-huh. me a trace so from the churches. From there, I really wanted to express myself mm. more. So I joined Christian Action Faith Ministry. And that's where I started singing. I also started singing with the choir. And we were singing real English songs. Action Faith, that's Archbishop Duncan Williams. Yeah. Oh, wow. We were okay. singing real English songs. We used to host a lot of American uh, pastors. Mm. Ora Roberts has come through. Oh, wow. Um, uh, Maurice Rulo. The yeah. Top, top American. So... I mean, if I sing Muto Brofu Waha, hey, my goodness. Oh, what a Brofu Kaya do? It's in Anya. So, because I was confined to that uh, environment mm. and I was really doing well with the singing and the English songs and everybody, you know, was enjoying it, I brought it into the open. Mm. I recorded English. But we were not ready then. At that time, the songs that were dominant were the uh, gospel guitar bands. Okay. Like Sechidumasi Gospel Band, uh, a lot of the gospel bands. Okay. Uh, 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 you know, uh, uh, Professor Kofi Abraham Gospel yeah. Band. Okay. So they were quartets, treble, auto, tenor, and bass. Four you know, of them, with yeah. Just mostly guitars. Uh, mm. So that was what was dominant. So when I recorded the um, English, Nkoye. Um, <laughs> <laughs> And you know, I recorded it in London too. Can you imagine? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my God. Very beautiful songs, but um, it didn't go anywhere. Because we were not ready okay. at that time. So that's my first one. So my first one that the public knows is the Daddy in a Ramosor Mamu Watum. So that that's it. Really? Yeah. And I am on, on board the one. Me, you won't suck. Okay. At, at, at this point, okay, is it fair to ask you, uh, perhaps to, for the sake of a, a generation probably that's uh, getting to know you and, and they've been singing your songs, they don't know are your songs. Can you just tease us a little bit with some of your songs? Like, uh, okay, yeah. Okay, good. Oh, yeah, it's good yeah, to be yeah, raising. Yeah, yeah. You know? There's a song I recorded. A lot of people sing it. And that song is uh, close to 30 years. Mm. And so, even when I'm at a program, these the young ones who are 28, 27, they sing it. You know? <laughs> and <laughs> it's a joy to watch. You know? Know. And they, they, they think that probably is a... It's a, a domain song. Yeah, uh, public domain. Yeah. A public domain song. But for me... It shows the effect. Right. By the grace of God, mm. I've had on people. Mm. And the song is... Nyankupong ya tronchomo. Wone ti asefo da de nyami. Na won sachra de biarada. It literally means, God, we worship you. You Wone ti asefo, how do I say that? You are the living God. And you never change. Yakoto sorrow. Enera, yesterday, today, and forever, you will be God. You will never change. Amen. Yeah. 
个朋友，也祝祝我，我你家是大的娘们，那我啥子？You are God yesterday. You are God today, and you will forever be God. Already, oh, you shouldn't count. Abra boimu iye kutuso iyo sika samdemu iye kutuso iyo amo fresh boimu. My household, we worship you. Reward of Glory, and you can literally feel some presence here. Wow. What a sweet presence. Please, this song, how did you get this song? Ah, <laughs> Sometimes, I, I, and I, there I, are descending I, listeners. I, 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 I want to... We have to impact I, them I, I, more. I, you know, Obi is saying here, oh, sorry, this is English. Someone no, is flow, listening. Flow. And is going through something. Yeah. How did you get this song? It's not going to do anything <laughs> for that person. Trust no, me. No, no, no. Somebody's list, what, listening or watching who has been slapped with some news that mm. he doesn't know what mm. to do. Mm. Maybe as we talk, mm. the husband says, pack, leave. Right. These are the real issues. I, I'm going you know, to I'm going to give you the chance to to zoom there. And, 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 uh, I didn't get this song. And the, when did you start singing? And how old were you when you started singing? How today. many albums do you have? I he know. I've grown past that. I know, but the, the, uh, so how many hours? 
I don't even know no, where I'm, they I'm are. I'm not going there. I... Let me tell you, there was a time. Okay. I and up to now, mm. even if I'm nominated, mm. I'll tell them to take me off. Why? No. What am I going to do with the award? I am a queen in the hearts of the Ghanaian. I work for the people and they love me and that's enough for me. So there was a time I was put on a category. At that time it wasn't VGMA, it was uh, what was it? It wasn't Nansena, they added okay, the yeah, to it. Yeah. And I because called, of Vodafone. The, yeah. I called them and I said, you know what? The younger ones oh, take wow. me off. So they need it. That's for some people that's the booster for them. Mm. Take me off the category. And don't ever add me, you know. Give it to the young. And if it today, if I should drop a song, I'll call them. Don't include me, cause I don't have time. Texting, vote for me, organizing people to vote. No, I don't mm. have time for that. What's that gonna you, do? You're that me? generous, but you know the reason I asked you because I was going to go to. There was there's a topic about receiving or writing scriptural songs. There are people who have said that some of you during your days you would go into if like fasting you receive the songs like that or you you are deliberate with writing the songs especially reverend yelson he okay. is good that way right yeah. so that's why i was asking you that how did you get a song like this is it from did the angels just <laughs> drop it on you when I, or you when sat I was back to my shower uh -huh. <laughs> I know, right? Well, it does happen sometimes. <laughs> ah, all the songs you've, but, but you've seriously, written. But seriously, I don't know whether that would do anything for people, mm. to be honest with you. Oh, you're, you're impacting the, a generation. You know, the, the, que the question the has been... The number of people, you have no idea your yeah, viewership. Listening yeah, from abroad. Or yeah. The number of musicians, the percentage of musicians mm. listening will be like 1%. percent mm. It'll be like one percent. But as a generation that would want to know, how do we yeah, get so songs we can like organize this? seminar for music, oh, okay. whatever, whatever. And if you want to delve deep into worship and how to connect with the spirit of mm. God, how to lead an effective how do you become an effective worshipper? We can do a seminar. Okay. Mm -hmm. But now we have people oh, this woman sings like an angel. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you're reading from the text console. Yeah. So they're going to tell us you, yes, I'm still the same person. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Very happy and blessed for bringing mom today. Thank you. I think I'll read Th it. There's one. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, let's go with your flow. Okay. okay. Let's go with your flow. Mm -hmm. So there's this one. This says, right. Thanks, Thanks a lot, Fifi. Yeah. My family. Okay. No, no. That Save oh. that one. Do the second okay. one. Yeah. I really, I really enjoy listening to Ancestella music a lot. I was playing it on City FM. On on Conti, it's Conti FM. In, in Unity oh, Hall. Conti FM. Yeah. In Unity Hall. Every Saturday Benito. dawn, oh, Bernard Adolf you. in Chihuahua uh, in Bahrain. Oh, okay, I see. Ah, yeah, oh, yeah, you're yeah. In Bahrain now. Yeah, oh, it's in God Bahrain now. Okay, uh, so we'll keep your messages coming in. Uh, Auntie Stella has her own agenda of how the interview should go, <laughs> and so I, I won't push it. Okay. But, well, the, the legend. That's why here, I so. like to be prepared. <laughs> yeah. And then when you tell your interview, uh, you are the host. Yeah. Wait, oh, you come, let's talk. Let's talk. <laughs> <laughs> I said, Give me an idea, give me a, 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 a you know, a, 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 some question. A gist so that, of what will a happen. Gist. Okay. Oh, you come. You come. <laughs> <laughs> what, what I wanted to know the flow, and so you said you surprised me, and that's what you have done. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going with your surprise. Yeah, uh, this was good morning, Chris and Cedric. I'm very happy and blessed for bringing my mom today. I've been impacted by her ministry tremendously. Mom, I love you so much. Uh, my name is Savior Wales. Let me go to this question i feel like to ask you what what do you think the impact is music to lives right mm -hmm. you, you've shared a, uh, a testimony on your journey of how going to schools have affected you know people mm -hmm. as it were mm -hmm. let's talk about the impact of gospel music on lives okay. perhaps that can lead you to minister exactly okay i love this question mm. um i think i can talk about me right because i'm the one here <laughs> <laughs> so i can probably give some examples or testimonies right i like know. that uh -huh. um i was in america i was having a program in delaware mm. and uh, there was a man of god who was invited he can't he, he he also came to enjoy the program mm. i think he led the opening prayer also mm. 
yeah or something he, he played a role and then he said he wanted to say something so i thought he was going to encourage the people with the <laughs> scripture or something like that yeah. then he said this woman he, in fact he he oversees uh, a number of apostolic churches mm. in, in 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 the area and he was transferred to another um, state mm. he's now in new york mm. you know <coughs> and he said when he was in ghana before he traveled you know something happened mm. and it was so bad i don't want to give the full you know right, it was right. so bad that he decided to end his life mm. yeah so he went he got a rope and went to under a tree a little bit isolated but you know how ghana we are loud we play music loud we don't mm -hmm. care about our neighbors <laughs> uh -huh. yeah so the the rope was ready and he was under the tree you know he, he said he was crying you know reflecting and yeah, he reflecting he was ready to kill himself and then he heard the song from afar being played on the radio Ah. He said he started crying and then instead of hanging himself for some reason he, he gathered some confidence came within him and wow. he felt like everything will be okay mm. you know and now he's not just a man of god apostolic church and he oversees other branches under him wow yeah and then there's another uh, uh, uh testimony of i went to sing at now he's uh uh, Apostle General Sam Crunchy at Christ Church. Mm. At that time, it was um, over here. B I at the Coco Mlimli, is yeah. Black Moor, is that? Uh, yeah. So I went after singing. I was sitting down, and there was a gentleman in suit. He came to kneel before. And it, in fact, when they did the altar call, those who came to write names and to usher the new Christians, the mm -hmm. new, he was one of them. So he, he ushered them out. And then he came back after the service he came to kneel before me and he said he chants and that one day he had woken up 4 a.m to chant and then he decided to brush his teeth so as he was brushing his teeth before he went to the bathroom he turned on the radio and then they started playing my song he said something arrested him hmm. And then he started, he broke down. He started crying. He said, he, said he knelt before his bed and he, he cried unto God and said he wants to give his life to the Lord. Wow. And since then, he's been, he found himself in that church. church. And now he's serving, you know, I can give you testimony support. Testimony right, support. Right. So I'll just limit it to. Wow. And it's an encouragement it for is. me. I, I mean, when I hear the stories, it's a, it's an encouragement mm. not to stop. So this goes beyond yeah. for me. That's for me. No, that's it. That's for that's me. It goes beyond award. This alone is enough for me. It, it's enough. If, for if me. you're tuned in this morning, wherever you are across the globe, and you believe that uh, Auntie Stella's music has been a blessing to you. You can actually, you know, find ways to let her have it, to encourage her. Uh, how, how does anyone reach you with these messages? Are you on social media active? Yeah, um, Stella Seal Ministry Facebook. Okay, Stella Seal Ministry Facebook. You can mm -hmm. you can do that. While I'm on says... You can follow. Uh -huh, follow, exactly. Mm -hmm. Do you have a YouTube channel? Yes, Stella okay. Seal. Stella Seal. Official. Yeah, go and get all the songs you don't know she <laughs> did over there. I'm so joyful that you're interviewing gospel, well, uh, diva Stella Seal, the voice I always long to listen to. I don't have all the time now, but as a mother here, I wanted to spend some time in prayer, if that's fine with you, especially for yes. those going to write B.C., go well in tomorrow there are a lot of people who are planning uh you know how it happens when you're going to face an exams yeah. i don't know how god will lead you but i want you to flow we've got the next seven minutes yeah. to just do ministry yes. so please go ahead 
my Jesus, I love you, I know thou art mine, for thee all the fallings of sin I resigned my gracious Redeemer my Savior oh, Thou I want to encourage you who is getting prepared to do your BEC, not only the children but the parents as well. It is well. The Lord is with you. And I pray for my young ones who are getting ready to write their exams. Holy Spirit, Spirit of God, bring to their remembrance. Even if they heard it once in class, bring to their remembrance. Help them. When they get to that confused stage as to which one to take, Holy Spirit, help them. About the boy one. School fees to your under form. Papa God, help your children. Help these little ones. Those who are afraid, those who are jittery. I pray for confidence. Confidence that comes from only you. And we pray, oh God, that they will come out with flying colors. There will, be, there will be nothing that will cause these papers to be canceled. We thank you and we bless you. And we decree and declare it with so and so it is. We bring parents before you. Papa God, people are saying times are hard. But we pray, oh God, increase their faith. Not just their, them, myself as well. All my listeners, increase our faith. Increase our faith of God. Help us in our weaknesses. Help us to be good people. Help us to watch over each other, not to steal from each other. Help us to be good citizens of Ghana. We give you glory. Papa God, Spirit of God, hover over this nation. Hover over this country. We speak peace. We decree and declare peace over the nation Ghana, over the families, over marriages, over businesses. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. What an awesome presence here. And I thank God for the privilege of hosting Mama uh, Stella Abbasi right here. I mean, you know, one of those interviews where you don't you don't have to ask anything. Just just go with the flow. And I wish I had all the time. I've seen a lot of messages coming in and I bless God. So keep the keyboards in the background for me. I think that it just it just does it for me. Oh wow. Yeah, glory, glory, glory. Ah. Oh. Uh, Susan says, I, I love her. I, I love her Jim Tata song. That song is extremely motivational. Good morning. Ah, ah, ah. Come on now. Good morning. 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 Good
Do not allow any obstacle to come my way. Now, me say, wasam no chere me say, we yo nyame. Wasam no chere me say, wutim hoda. You remain the same. Wasam no chere me say, wo ye da de nyame. Eja wongo ani meni da suwa bara boy. Na ne nyame wongo. You are my only hope, the hope of Ghana. And unti jian tata, jian kang kosi fie jojo na yeni obo afobia obema yenga sumjie ah. Yesu me duyen yeni obia na yemo wa we firi beba. Nanenya mi ebo ame ah one me ni da so me mo afi ewade se me mi emanwa hey na me bo mpaya ye nejo wasu wona woni I mean, I feel that the presence of the Lord is here healing and delivering the people, you know, giving you that clarity of mind. You know, the Lord is ministering to you. He's touching lives here. Connect with your heart. If Thank you're sick God. In any part mm. of your body, I mm. want you to place your hand there. Yes. So, Yari will be a found Satuho, a ready so soon. And Namufidianum, the Spirit of God does not know boundaries. Father, we thank you and we bless your wonderful name. I bring my sisters and brothers who are sick in their bodies before you. The great healer, the great provider, we release, we decree, and we declare healing from the crown of their heads to the soles of their feet, from migraines to sore throats to cancers to breast cancers to intestinal problems, kidneys, livers, joint pains, high blood pressure, cholesterol issues, barrenness, erectile dysfunctions. Papa God, heal your children. You are the great physician. You are the great physician. We release the healing of God over your people. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Receive it with faith. Thank you. Yes, Lord. 
Yes, Lord. Receive it with faith wherever yes, you Lord. are. Tune in to Joy 99.7. That's Mama Hallelujah. Stella Abbasia. I got a text from my mother for you. My mother sent me a message for you. Oh. Uh, she says, Mama, thanks for being here at such a time like this Amen. to impact generations through your ministry and vision. Amen. God, open greater, greater doors Amen. for you. Mama. We love you. Please. Amen. And she says, please open workshops to train the up and coming gospel singers for our generation. Thank you. Congratulations. That's my mama. Auntie Thank Tetra. You. Annie Joyce, Thank and she you. loves you, right? And yeah, for Michelle. all the messages that have come through, uh, Jackie Ankara shared what with me. Yeah, Jackie. <laughs> Jackie? <laughs> yeah, Jackie shared what with me. Jackie says, uh, oh my goodness, you know. Uh, um, she says, uh, send a love and hug. Stella paved the way for many of us and is such an inspiration. Glory to God. Well, Honorable JB uh, Boama is here and uh, he's he's so excited. Uh, says, Boama, God bless you. And all the other messages that have come through, we thank God for your lives thank you for the feedback as well i wish i had more time but you know time is of the essence we gotta go mama has been a blessing I've to us more yeah than seven minutes. i know right? <laughs> yeah yeah yes. i pray the management will pardon me yeah uh you know sometimes it's like that right mm -hmm. so thank you so very much please find me across social media yes, especially yes. subscribe to a youtube channel yeah get all the other details follow her on facebook and if you have any testimony to share through her ministry please let it go to her so thank you on behalf half of management and all of us here yeah thank awesome. you so very much mama stella god bless you my name is pp paulson may his grace see us through every life's race with an extra pace no enemy can chase yes i want to thank my keyboardist oh already show he is single so if you're looking <laughs>